Hi, I'm Sandy Peterson, and these are the four faction expansions that you get with original Cthulhu Wars. We're going to go through each one of them in order and see what's inside. First, let's look at Opener of the Way. What comes in here? Well, there is his rules. Mostly it's not rules, it's like how to play him, how to defeat him, that kind of thing. Then there's his spell books and cult glyph. We have his faction card. And here is what you really wanted, the figures. So here is Yogg-Sothoth himself, two mighty spawn of Yogg-Sothoth, three abominations, four mutants, and of course, six cultists. If you want us and a power and a uh, doom marker. The Opener of the Way expansion. The Sleeper. Faction card. Complete with a little story from a uh, hardboiled detective novel. Spellbooks and his glyph, rules and hints and tips to how to play him, and the figures. We got Seth Agawa, four form formless spawn, which are set in there fairly tight. And then in this bag, which I'm going to rip open. We have two wizards, three serpent men, six cultists, and of course, our doom and faction markers, or uh, power markers. There we go. The sleeper. Windwalker expansion. Spell books and a glyph marker, faction card, tips and tricks of playing Windwalker, and of course Ithaca himself in all his glory, his little buddy Ron Tagoth, Doom marker, his Ice Age marker, four Gnoff care, the Tower marker. Six cultists, all pale. Where's the Nafkaz? And, of course, gotta have the Wendigos. And we do. And there it is the Windwalker. The final one of our original faction expansions is Azathoth, the neutral expansion. Let's see what we get inside Azathoth. We have Azathoth's loyalty card, so you can summon him. We have loyalty cards for all four of the monster types we're going to see in here in a minute, with of course rules for them on the back. We have the, Az the rules for how to use all of Azathoth's stuff, not super lengthy, but enough to get what you need. Azathoth's spellbooks. These are the six that anyone can get, and this is Azathoth's personal private spellbook that you only get if you control Azathoth, and of course he has a glyph marker too, because actually this is the strength of Azathoth on the map it gets used. So, oh, it came falling out, but that's okay. We have three star vampires. We have three dimensional shamblers. Put this bag, see what we got. We got three Elder Things springing there out of the darkness. I really like these Elder Thing models. They're much better than the normal sea cucumbers that you see. And there's, a, there's the Servitors of the Outer Gods. And finally, last, and certainly not least, Azathoth himself, the Demon Sultan. And this is the stuff you get in the Azathoth expansion. 
This is everything you get in the four faction expansions for the original Cthulhu Wars game. In the upcoming Onslaught 2, we are adding another faction expansion. It's the Chochos. And even though they are technically a human faction, they are probably the most alien and strange of all the factions, so watch for them. So here we are with the big picture, all this stuff. And you know what? With all this, it still only takes an hour and a half to play. You're probably thinking, look at all that. That's a mountain of material. But this is only part of it. We couldn't fit it all on the table, so you're only seeing part of what we have. And don't forget, with Onslaught 2, there's going to be seven new expansions, some of them free. So watch for that, too. And you can, ha you can fill your living room with monsters.